okay so uh, due to the lot of request uh, i'm making this video this is on the texas instrument test so i will just briefly cover what are the topics that you have to uh, study for texas instruments so basically it consists of two things it is aptitude and technical so i will cover this uh, and uh, at last i will give you one most crucial tip which will help you to crack texas in instrument test as uh, texas in instrument takes the test first then it takes the interview so cracking the test is more crucial yes. so uh, watch till the end i will give you a very crucial tip, tip to crack it so let's directly get into it so first we have technical uh, first first you will be having an aptitude so okay so aptitude and then you are you will be having your technical so first we will just discuss aptitude so the level of the question is very basic okay so it is very basic yet uh, the time is very less for the aptitude part so that's why you have to be very much uh, fast in the calculation and very much fast in the solutions so you can solve sscg questions you can solve uh, banking questions but don't solve gate questions because gate questions require uh, a bit time there and it is lengthy and also don't solve uh, the cat questions so these are the level of the questions are uh, of ssj and banking not gate and cat so uh, in like every year the texas instruments repeats its pattern so first of all you have to study syllogism so every year you will see the questions on syllogism so what is syllogism so you i uh, some some trees are plants and that type of questions but this is not so if some uh, if some plants are tree and if no plants is uh, water so this type of questions are there so no some uh, tell this if some water is a tree so this type of questions you have so this is syllogism and then you have wien diagram so you can accept you can expect one one or two questions from each uh, uh, from each of this so what is the wien diagram one so the wien diagram is also important because uh, the type of question that you will get is in some class some study uh, some play cricket some play football some play tennis and sorry some play tennis and this the, if 10 play this 15 play this 20 play this and 12 play this so tell me how many this will play how many this will play so this type of questions you will definitely there will be definitely one type of questions one type of question like one question on this type of uh, concept and the third you will get is work work and time so first i am just telling you what is the must that you should uh, study this is work time so work time you might you might be knowing a does on the work in 5 days and b does the, the work in 10 days so if they do together what is the time so that is the work and time then you can have a speed and distance speed and distance so in the speed and distance uh you can cover the river problem like this year they have asked river problem i think previous year they have asked uh, the boat no not boat the previous year i think they have asked the train problem so there are many problems uh, set of problems you follow that and then they can ask a uh, profit and loss profit and loss uh, simple as well as compound 
then you have mixture and ratio this is also very much important you will at least see one questions on mixture and ratio okay mm, so this is very much must and this is also very much must this is must this is must so uh, sp uh, profit and loss is not that much must but this whatever i am making star that is must this is must profit and loss is also there but this are the must things then you will have direction again direction is also must you, you will expect one at least one or two, two questions on this directions north and south if someone is someone goes here east west south if someone goes 15 meter here then turns right that type of questions then you will have sitting arrangement so sitting arrangement is again important like these are the must questions like the must topics there will be there so sitting arrangement one or two questions definitely they will ask and then they can ask uh, the uh, passage comprehensive so passage comprehensive this year they have not asked but uh, previous year they have i think they have asked like i have seen uh, four mtech branch uh, no three mtech batches so i know the pattern of the paper of texas and in, in my btech also i have given texas instrument test so from that experience i'm telling you all all these things so passages okay okay mm, and like, huh, again blood relation you, you should blood relation always will be there blood relation will always be there then i'll remove this now to write the now blood relation okay then puzzles will be there puzzles like all this are the basic uh, questions and the number system then permutation combination so basic questions on permutation combination permutation and combination and probability so the most important topics are venn diagram venn diagram syllogism work and time speed speed profit and loss leave it mixture direction setting arrangement passage uh, not that much important but still blood relation also like one question you can accept so, so medium puzzles also medium number system also medium but permutation and combination and probability this this will be this type of questions will be there so study the uh, practice this questions and the tip that i have to give you give you is okay i will uh, do after the technical so i so in the technical one so in technical the most important r circuits you will have at least two to three questions on our rc circuits then you have diodes again more important like much important because the topics in the technical is uh, a bit less so you will have one or two questions on this also and then you have bgts so you can also ex expect one one questions on bgt and then you have mosfets so on mosfets you can ex expect two three questions like id current you can they will give you wil and tell you to calculate id they will tell you if the mosfet is in saturation or linear and they can uh, they will also they can also ask you uh, like the famous type of questions if this is this this is vdd and then 
this is this vdd this is this vdd so what are what is the voltage of this they can ask so so on this type of questions also you, you should cover okay so again uh, they can ask you and and, and nowadays uh, many companies are asking about five five triple timer five triple timer so also one one questions one question will be there on this and then you and then you have is charge conservation on charge conservation they can ask and uh, again opam most important opam they will ask sorry sorry for this okay so opam they will ask two questions on opam two three questions of of on opam there will be there uh, it will be there then laplace transform they can ask laplace transform so see the laplace things not direct question on laplace transform like using laplace you have to solve the circuits so that they will ask and nowadays they are uh, asking the transfer function like they are uh, giving you the poles and zero and dc value and they are telling you what is the transfer function so that also you can see and then yes by looking at circuit looking at the circuit they are telling to calculate the transfer function so we'll write in this only from circuit transfer function they can tell you then yes then most important uh, most like most important means one question will definitely be there and you should also study signal and systems okay so in signal and systems most important is lti systems lti systems see the laws of lti system then convolution so uh, on signal systems there will be oh, one or two questions one or two questions and uh, from this topic they can ask it, it's not sure that they will ask on convolution only but this this you have to study because they will definitely ask the questions on this this are the most okay so then in this what they can ha they can ask uh, causality they can ask linearity study that okay so these are the questions that is uh being asked in texas uh, texas instruments test so sorry that and one more uh, one of the favorite question like most uh, popular question that is being going on which way vein bridge of uh, oscillator vein bridge oscillator you should study like what are the uh, mm, like there that will there will be this type of circuit right and here there will be an rc circuit this type of circuit is there and then they are asking you the frequency of oscillation they are asking you the resistor of the, um, this resistor calculate the value of this re resistor to get sustain oscillation and so on so uh, study that vein bridge also okay so these were the questions uh, like this were the topics that you have to study and the tip is the in the test will consist um, the test will consist of just a second i'll change the color so test will consist of two to three such questions which are very very much hard two three two to three questions will be very hard it is just to trap you this is trap and most of the students get trap in this so two to three two to three questions will be very much hard and again two to three questions will be very easy 
not two to three you can also tell us three to four three to four questions will be very easy so try to find that very easy questions and try to find that very hard questions so eliminate very hard questions and try to solve just easy questions first so most of the student what they do they stuck on one questions and they try uh, and they try it for whole of the time and the time goes on and then and they are not able to crack the test so don't do that and uh, in interview calculator is not allowed it calculator is not allowed it so that you take care calculator is not allowed it so practice the questions make your cal calculation faster and uh, in question there will be two to three questions where uh, you might uh, think that that question requires the calculator but actually it is not requirable because uh, what they will do i will just tell you um, what they did in at my time so there was an rc circuit and they told me to uh, so they have given me the 5 volts and they told me to calculate what will be v out at just a second so they told me to calculate what will be the v out at uh, what will be the time at v out is equal to 3.5 volts okay and r and c value was given so let's take 1 ohm and 1 picofarad or something so what do you think and they have given the step step voltage like this so what do you think how will calculate this you might think that this will need a calculator but actually if you closely see this 3.5 is 5 into 0 0.6 c that means this is a what is this value this is the value of time constant so what is time constant so time constant is when uh, you reach 63 percent of initial value so uh, sorry final value so final value is 5 and initial uh, 63 percent of the fine 5 is this one so the time is directly tau you don't need to calculate anything so this is how the questions are so you just have to uh, look in a different way to solve the questions so all the best for your test whenever you you, you will be giving and thank you subscribe the channel to get this type of uh, videos and you can comment on this video and if you want a video on some uh, particular topic and i will try my level best to give you that content thank you thank you all